best game. She's dying. Oh. Alien isolation. Let me be. Let the devil take me. Destiny. Dragon Age Inquisition. Mario Kart 8. Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. You shouldn't have come here, Ranger. Monument Valley. And the BAFTA goes to destiny. Well, hello. It's truly humbling to be here with all of you. Uh, it's really exciting to, uh, to be able to accept this award on behalf of the Bungie team, their friends and family that support us through development. It's always uh, a labor of love uh, that we do uh, because of the passion of the fans that play the game. They really are the ones that drive you to put the energy and time into to putting the game together. Um, so I want to thank the fans, uh, especially those in the UK, given that we're here, and um, the BAFTA group committee for, uh, for nominating us and, and our publishers and, and everyone else. Um, thank you for this and keep playing if you're playing. If you're not playing, play Destiny. <laughs> Harold, yeah? as I was just saying, we're supposed to be impartial, but destiny, psh, bestiny, right? Yeah. Am I right? Um, I have literally lost hours of my life to this game. It's the only game I've played every single day, so I am thrilled. I can only imagine what someone who's, who's responsible for the game is feeling. How, how does it feel? I mean, it's, it's amazing to build something people love to play so much. Uh, you know, we've always at Bungie made games that we love to play, and uh, Destiny, maybe we love to play a little too much sometimes. There are some days when we... People come in blurry-eyed, you know. Maybe, <laughs> maybe when Zer shows up and with the, with the, like when he showed up with Icebreaker, was just the whole studio was pretty much in late the next day. Uh, and the, uh, yeah, people are playing. So you know, people are still playing three hours a day. That's me. That's you, so yeah. And a lot of people me, in the studio. It cost me a relationship, but I'm fine with it. Yeah. It's fine. And uh, <laughs> you know, to see fans, we have fans that are you know, average players playing 77 hours of Destiny if they're an engaged player. It's just, it's amazing to build something people like that much. And for Destiny, there was, uh, it was a long time coming. There was a lot of hard work before launch, obviously. Yeah. But then through the alpha and the beta and now millions of people playing it, how has that changed the experience of being responsible for Destiny? How has it helped Destiny? Yeah, I mean, the, um, certainly all of the feedback from the fans are super passionate. We hear from them all the time. It's the thing that really pushes us, drives us to keep doing more, pushing harder, staying focused at the office. You know, there's, you know, there's no end to in sight for what we're going to do in Destiny, the number of the amount of feedback we're reacting to and the number of changes we're going to make in the game. I mean, it, for me, it's gaming-wise, the Vault of Glass completing that, Crotozen completing that, and then yeah. this week doing Flawless Raid on the Vault of Glass. They're yeah. th genuinely three of the most incredible experiences I've, uh, I've sort of had in a, in a game. And I promised I wouldn't ask you about <laughs> Vault Space. I'm not going to ask you about Vault uh -huh. Space. I'm not going to ask you about Zer selling Galahorn. <laughs> but I have to promise a friend, yeah? is there a six chess in the Vault of Glass? You know, you'll have to look and see. I've looked! I've looked, Harold! Um, what's next? What's next for Destiny? Obviously, House of Wolves around the corner. Yeah, and House then beyond of, that? House of Wolves is, is coming, coming out uh, Q2, so this summer-ish, if you're in the north side of the, of the world. Yep. Winter if you're in the south. <laughs> the, uh, but, um, yeah, that's as, that's as much as we're talking about what's coming next, other than there's a lot more coming, a lot more action, a lot more adventure, and a lot more story. I'm not going to ask you anything yeah. more now because you totally deserve not to answer any more questions and go and have a drink and right. enjoy <laughs> that. But so many congratulations, yeah, Harold. Thank well you. Done. Have Brilliant. a great night. Yeah, thanks.